The TRX is a great tool for doing row exercises because it uses your body weight and you can really adjust it easily as you go through. So when you set up the TRX, you want to make sure that it's set up about six feet high and anchored nice and securely. The length downward for the TRX should be about knee to mid shin height so you have enough length to work with. Now as we set up the row, I want you to imagine like it's the upside down push up. So we're gonna keep a nice straight body from head to heels, nice and tall through our neck, and instead of pushing, we're gonna be pulling and rowing. So here I'm gonna set up to make it easy, my feet pretty far from the anchor point so that I don't have to lean back too far. Leaning back, straight body, my shoulders are locked down, and then I let them reach forward. From here, I'll pull my elbows back, squeeze between my shoulder blades, and then lower. Some people like to keep their palms facing each other. Some like to start palm up and finish palm down. Whatever you want to do is just fine. To make it a bit more difficult, we just move our feet further forward. The technique stays the same, keeping our body nice and straight by locking our knees, squeezing our glutes, proud chest. Let our shoulders come forward. Then we're going to pull our shoulders back, pull those elbows back, squeeze, and control down, keeping our shoulders down even as they glide forward a bit. That is your TRX row.